I think the, the, the catalyst for student interest is often initially around something that bothers them, something that they wish was different. Um, I think it's good when, when that kind of energy is coming to an adult mentor to, to invite students to express the vision that informs that resistance or that opposition by asking them, you know, well, okay, so what are you for? And how can you ex creatively express what you're for? And to talk about like core values and to talk about conversations with people um, around sort of shared vision and shared values. Um, because I do think it's easy to mobilize people to protest, and especially adolescents. I mean, there's something about being anti-authority, right? But, um, but I also think helping them to, to think creatively about what they're yearning for and to think um, strategically about how that's constructed. Um, I think it's also really important to bring them into contact with adults who have traveled that journey, not for the adult to say, well, here's where I've arrived at and how you can become like me. I, I think adults have to talk about themselves as being companions on that journey. Um, but I think adults who have been committed to this kind of work for the long haul bring a kind of wisdom, a sense of process, um, like this is a marathon, it's not a sprint. Um, that's good for young people to partner with. I think it's mutually beneficial because I think sometimes, oftentimes, adults get weary <laughs> from the journey and get anxious about like who's going to do this work when I'm not doing it anymore. So I think it's, it's not an either or. Um, I think that kind of intergenerational partnership um, is key to the process.